Dear user, thanks for using Ocean Alpha on Mano Surface Vehicle. Upon receiving the USV, please unpack and check if all items in the box. Set up the USV after unpacking. The first thing is to install the batteries. Open the equipment cabin, connect the USB cable and the equipment cable. Install the antenna. Install the sampling bottle. Install the remote control antenna. Test the USB after installation is done. Turn on the USB. Turn on the remote controller. Make sure all the connectors are tightened. Next is to check the propulsion system. Push the left joystick forward, the left propeller rotates. Push the right joystick forward, the right propeller rotates. Next is sampling test. Push the sampling bottoms, the sampling tube will be lowered. Block the inlet tube with your finger. If there's air blowing out, that means the sampling function is working. Rotate the speed bottoms to adjust the sailing speed. You can choose your sampling amount with the joystick. Remote control mode bottoms. Propulsion joysticks. Sailing light. For more details, please refer to our user menu. Bolt charging. Plug in the charger. Open the charging port lid. Align the white dot to connect the cable. Turn on the charging bottom. The cooling fan starts working and the red light turns on. That means the bolt is being charged. The cooling fan stops working and the light turns green. That means the charging is finished. When charging the remote controller, red light means charging, green light means finished. After the ground test is finished, test the USB in the water. Two factors should be checked before launching the USB into the water. First of all is the battery percentage. Turn on the USB and you can see the battery percentage on the remote. Make sure you have more than 70%. Second, Check if the launching ground is solid. Lift and place the USB on the water surface. Direct the USB to the sampling location. Push the sampling bottoms when the USB reaches its destination. Choose the sampling amount. Push the confirm buttons to monitor the sampling process. Direct the USB back to the shore after the mission is accomplished. Take out the sampling bottle and retrieve the USB. And here you go. That is all you need to know about the SS20 USB water sampling process. Easy, right?